Franz, great news on your driver lineup for next year. That's out in the open. Just wanted to start off talking about Pierre. He had such a great year this year so far. What were the instincts behind keeping him for another year? He is so fast. <laughs> Why we should lose such a good driver? Yeah, uh, Pierre for me belongs uh, to the best drivers in Formula One. And uh, I'm more than happy that Red Bull uh, decided uh, that Pierre Gasly stays with us also in 2022 together with Yuki Tsunoda because you must not forget next year we have a new regulation and it's really important that uh, we have at least from the drivers a constant uh, stability in there and uh, I think that this will help the team enormously. And has he played a key role in helping Yuki settle in as well to life in Formula 1? Of course, if there's such a fast driver in the team, it's a big help and support for the other driver. And uh, Yuki is a, a rookie driver, he is uh, the first time in Formula 1, the first year. And uh, he can compare now the data um, from uh, Pierre and uh, this helps him to increase his performance. Now yesterday Yuki said he was surprised when he found out that you were keeping him for another year and he was asked why and he said well because I keep crashing. What did you make of Yuki's performance this year? Look, Yuki crashed a couple of times but that's part of the game. You can't expect that a young driver come into Formula 1 and that everything uh, works without any uh, problems. Look, for example, here in Monza or at any other track, he's the first time out in FB1 with a Formula 1 car. It's not only him, it's for all the rookies the same. And the second half of the season, he comes even to race tracks uh, which he doesn't know. He will come to America, he doesn't know, as well as uh, Mexico, uh, then uh, Sao Paulo, uh, okay, Saudi Arabia, they all don't know. But Istanbul, he doesn't know, it will become not so easy. But Yuki in the meantime is quite familiar with the car, he knows how to speed up and he showed this also today in the free practice and I think that um, for next year we have a very strong driver lineup. we will work very hard with both drivers and um, I'm optimistic from this point of view.